All right, our first guest, he's usually standing right here next to me, but because, well, because we're dealing with all this social distancing, he's got some things to do as well. He's going to join us live via Skype, Eric Shepard, Waco Civic Theater. Welcome to the show. Hey, how you doing, Brian? I'm well. Hey, let's talk doing, about... Being safe, washing your hands, doing all that stuff. I am. I've got my hand sanitizer right over there. Trust me, I'm all over Good it. Deal. Okay, let's talk about what you guys are doing and how you're dealing with a lot of the cancellations and the, 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 the banning of people gathering 10 or more. What's going on with Waco Civic Theater? Well, we've gone on hiatus. Uh, it hasn't stopped uh, me from uh, raiding our costume closet, though, as you can see. <laughs> uh, sort of a normal uh, Wednesday, uh, weekday sort of thing to do anyway. This is how we dress at the theater all the time. What am I talking about? <laughs> um, we're on hiatus. Uh, no audience is coming into the building, and uh, we are hoping to be able able to produce, you know, in the next month or so. But you know, we'll have to wait and see how that goes. So we put our shows on a hold, and uh, we hope that we can uh, start meeting for rehearsals and then open up the theater, um, you know, when it gets warmer. In the next couple of days, we're going to have, especially next next, I think Tuesday, Wednesday, we have scheduled. Uh, musicians to come on the show and talk about how the stoppage of all these tours and the festivals and plays like yourself has affected their industry. Now, I know that you guys, you know, what does this do to, to kind of the, I don't know, the, the camaraderie that many of you guys have with all meeting on a weekly basis, on a nightly basis, going over your shows? How have you guys stayed in communication to what you have coming up in production? Well, like a lot of people, we're on Facebook quite a bit, and we text message each other and Facebook message each other um, <clears throat> because that's about all we've got at the moment. Now, we are interacting in a way, and we're going to move that to the outside world sometime soon. Each of our cast members is going to do a video uh, of something that they're doing in their life and how it relates to the theater. So we'll have... Um, uh, folks uh, practicing social distancing as the folks uh, would have done during Emma's time, which is our next show. And we'll have previews of our upcoming season, whenever it is we get to do it, uh, done by cast members and folks from Waco Civic Theater. So we're staying connected with each other uh, and using uh, this great technology that we've got uh, so we can see each other and talk to each other and, and still perform, just not for a live audience. There you go. I've always wondered, Eric, what is in your closet? I don't know if you could turn that camera just a little bit. You said you're in the wardrobe area there? Oh. I'm on stage, actually. You can see the set of Emma behind me. Uh, and uh, I'm uh, wearing something that someone would have worn back in the 19th century. <laughs> uh, and uh, then you can see, I'm going to turn it around again. You can see the lovely piano that we created for the show. Look which is that. just waiting for someone to play it and those empty chairs waiting for someone to occupy them. I love it. I love it. Uh, meanwhile, I'm going to sit in this comfy chair over here, and we can have the rest of our conversation in this fancy chair. Well, I, I appreciate you taking time out of your schedule. And once again, Eric, if someone wants more information, once you guys get back up and rolling, what's the best way to do that? We'll have uh, posts on our website. Uh, we have an email system, so uh, make sure you take our email out of spam if it's somehow ending up in the junk folder. Also, uh, our website, and uh, we have an Instagram and a Twitter feed as well. We'll get the word out through all the means that we can. It's wacocivictheater.org, or check out our Facebook page. Those are uh, probably the best ways. You look pretty comfy to me, my friend. Uh, I, yeah, I'm making the best of the situation, <laughs> Brian. All right, Eric Shepard, thanks for joining us. Thanks, Brian.